Good Friday morning, Southwest Florida. I'm Fox 4 meteorologist Trent Eric as we look eastbound from our camera down in the Bayfront Inn in Naples. We're starting to see just a little hint of that daylight coming up over the horizon. Our sunrise happens uh, shortly before 740 this morning and our temperatures are off to a really nice start. A little bit warmer than where we were at this time 24 hours ago, but still a couple upper 50s on the map along State Road 29 between LaBelle and Immokalee and along the coast 63 Fort Myers 64 in the Cape and as we go throughout the afternoon, we're going to warm up nicely, but you can see that change here early, especially for Lee, Charlotte and DeSoto County, about a four to three degree jump and running pretty much even from Immokalee all the way towards Cluiston. Now the dew point value is still really comfortable as well. We're in the low to mid fifties, but the humidity is going to start creeping back up a bit as we go through the weekend and this afternoon with that east northeasterly breeze, we'll sit right around 84 degrees, a little warmer in the southern parts of Collier. That reading is just one above our average which is down to 83 here today. Overnight, we'll go in the mid to upper 60s and you can see how that stacks up with the Almanac just a touch above average. And boy, last year, November got off to a really hot start every day so far this month. The record has been last year. Today, the record was 91 record low on the flip side, 45 back in 1966. Radar really quiet here early. That east northeasterly breeze kicking up a few showers north of us off the Space Coast while we remain dry. The breeze will continue today east northeast 15 miles miles per hour. We'll see the gusts in the 20s and notice there is just not enough moisture to support any type of fast moving showers. So we'll stay breezy and dry and currently the wind is less than 10 miles per hour and the gusts not an issue yet, but between 10 and lunchtime we'll start to see the winds pick up. The forecast calls for those sustained winds to be near 15 and those gusts 20 to 25 miles per hour here as we're going to wrap up the work week here a little on the breezy side. Cool air across the eastern half of the US and then there's central and south Florida. 52 Jacksonville, 76 in Miami. Really warm stuff over on the East Coast as that wind picks up the warmth of the Gulf Stream and acts like a heater overnight. And that's a typically a cooler morning for us. Why well, is this high pressure ridge in front do a battle here over the next couple of days? It will keep the breeze up and a little more moisture starts to work in here on Saturday. That will allow for a little higher humidity, but by Sunday and especially overnight into Monday, we'll get another reinforcing shot of cooler air. Quick check of the tropics. Now Hurricane Center still watching this area to our south. Good news over the last couple of days, just a 20% chance low as it moves towards Central America. The seven day forecast shows the temperature staying above our average of 83. The winds that have been a little bit of a nuisance will relax there Sunday as we wait for that secondary cold front bringing us some cooler mornings there on Monday.